anti-homosexuality, LGBTQIA+. Man is for woman, woman is for man. God is love, that's right. But this doesn't mean that you will now be a homosexual. God loves you and he doesn't want you to have a miserable life. God hates homosexuality. So God created man in his own image. In the image of God created he him. Male and female created he them. Genesis chapter 1 verse 27. Thou shalt not lie with mankind as with womankind. It is abomination. Neither shalt thou lie with any beast to defile thyself therewith. Neither shall any woman stand before a beast to lie down thereto. It is confession. Leviticus chapter 18 verses 22 to 23. Lo, this only have I found, that God hath made man upright, but they have sought out many inventions. Ecclesiastes chapter 7 verse 29. For this cause God gave them up unto vile affections. For even their women did change the natural use into that which is against nature, and likewise also the men, leaving the natural use of the women, burned in their lust one toward another, men with men working that which is unseemly, and receiving in themselves that recompense of their error which was meet. Romans chapter 1 verses 26 to 27. Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? Be not deceived. Neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor abusers of themselves with mankind, nor thieves, nor covetous, nor drunkards, nor revilers, nor extortioners, shall inherit the kingdom of God. 1 Corinthians chapter 6 verses 9 to 10. And have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness, but rather reprove them, for it is a shame even to speak of those things which are done of them in secret. But all things that are reproved are made manifest by the light. For whatsoever doth make manifest is light. Ephesians chapter 5 verses 11 to 13. I was born like this. If that's already your way of thinking, God has provided a solution. You need to be born again. Jesus answered and said unto him, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. John chapter 3 verse 3. I came not to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. Luke chapter 5 verse 32. For God so loved the world, that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. John chapter 3 verse 16. Jesus saith unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father, but by me. John chapter 14 verse 6 For the wages of sin is death, but the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Romans chapter 6 verse 23